Hello everyone and welcome back to Forager, where I'm not entirely surprised there was an enormous amount of interest in seeing more content. So here we are. This, I'm still unsure if it's going to be a mini series or a full series uh, with the, these sorts of incremental games. Uh, it's a little bit hard to say how it would uh, deal with being a full series, but we're going to keep our eye on it all the same. Now then, we've got generally uh, odds and sods in there. Ah, oh, I could put glass in there, I suppose. But I'd like this for my raw minerals chest, or raw building materials, if you like. We'll need another vault for some other things in time. Uh, two digging spots. Fantastic. Let's uh, dig those up. We've got uh, an arrow, I believe. Uh, also, I would like some food. Uh, let's go ahead and eat. Some beats. There we go. And one over there. Thank you, everyone who uh, commented uh, that I had been missing something behind my furnaces. You were, in fact, quite, quite correct. I had been. Like a doop. Uh, let's uh, go ahead and grab you. There we are. Now, this little area, I think, would be perfect for a windmill. Uh, it's not much land, but it seems seems uh, just fine for, for a windmill, or maybe even two. So let's have a quick look and what would be involved in doing that. We need a lot of bricks and a reasonably large amount of thread, but we've also got a skill up. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab you. What are we gonna go for though is the question. Now this, there are a couple of things. We've got co commerce, which is fantastic. Supply would market sell more items. I mean, that would be kind of cool as well. And we've got automation. Unlocks mining rods, crafted items, collect themselves. Now that. Crafted items collect themselves. Sounds bloody awesome if you ask me. But we've also got agriculture down here. Unlock sprinklers, animals yield 25% more resources. Farms yield 25% more resources. That sounds quite cool. And a lot of people have been pointing out that I basically not done anything with magic. And maybe maybe that's a bit dumb. Um hmm. it's a it's a tricky one that. It's a genuinely tricky one. I wouldn't mind getting cooking up and running. Uh, and fishing, having my fishing traps, catching things a little bit faster would also be good. But uh, I think we're going to go with oh, so many good options. We're going to go with automation. I would like crafted items to collect themselves. And probably soon after that, we're going to go with magic. I I'm thinking we need to check out the magic tree. This is something I've not done anything with, so I have no idea how useful it'll be or what may be uh, locked behind. Give me your eggs, damn it. Uh, there we are. You can't live on my islands rent-free, you know. I think it's quite fair that I demand an egg now and then. Uh, right, down here. That, that being said, it was probably your island first. We're just going to ignore that part, though. Uh, there we go. And a bunch of nice things there. Excellent. Now, we've got to collect some torch bugs, I believe it was, for you. Also, a bunch of people told me to go and check out the house in here. So let's go and do that. There we go. And go upstairs? No, but this is moving around. Okay. Uh, right. Let's have a look. Slime hat. Basic hat. Clothier's hat? What? Plantera? Lunatic cultist? Terraria slime? Um. Well. I'm, most of these are from Terraria. That's glorious. Uh, let's, let's go to basic though and see the other options. So we got a fish. I can be a fish or I can be ba- uh, I'm gonna be basic. Uh, backpack, I can sort of no backpack if I particularly want to. And my vampire wings. Now then. Hmm. Come on. We can't say no to this. Uh, I'm walking around the bone pick as well. Ah, oh, this all feels very, very right somehow. It all feels like everything is coming together as needed. I have 1,000 items in my inventory. Marvelous. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and build out a little bridge over here though. So I can connect up. Should I need to? What we got over there? We've got a beef. Uh, let's go and talk with the beefs. Hello, beefs. Also, we've got a dig spot. I shall grab that too. Uh, grab some items. Uh, hello, beefs. I can't get anything from you. And yet, I feel that I'll probably be able to later on. So I'm going to let you live for now. Well done, you. You've won the, the Mercy Lottery. Uh, we can't really buy anything in here. I could sell off some things. Uh, I'm gonna sell off the arrows, just so I'm not filling up my inventory with, with random gubbins that I don't really need. 
Uh, that will be fine for now. There we are, a little bit of slime, also good. Okay, right, I am exhausted. Yes, I am. I really wish I could rebind the keys, but I have yet to find a way that I can do that, which is most, most vexing, I will confess. Oh no, so sorry, chicken. Please heal. I am I am a very bad havoc. Right, anyway, we need a bunch of bricks. Uh, well, we don't need that many. Let's just uh, craft 30. Well, I already have two, so I'll uh, make 28. Early on, I'm probably going to be quite specific with things. I don't have any means to do that. I've got loads of uh, glass I could make. Uh, sure. Let's go ahead and make... Yeah, let's let's make all eight pieces of glass. That would be grand. Let's go and grab some more of you. Hello. Thank you very much for the egg there. All right, what can we do? We need leather, four leather. Uh, and I need an emerald and 12 hot peppers. Okay, we... we the, look. The beef may not be long for this world, as I can't get leather from chickens, thankfully. Unlike many games that I've played, where you could get leather from chickens, Dwarf Fortress being chief amongst them, uh, I'm not sure we would want to make any, any clothing out of chicken leather. I can't imagine that would be particularly nice. There we go. Now then. All right, hello, beef. Uh, oh, wow. Two of them right next to each other? Very well. I accept some more arrows that I can sell. Excellent. Right. I'm sorry about this. I, I truly am. There we are. Two hides that I will be able to use to make a little bit of something. Uh, right. We're going to be... That's going to be working for quite some time. I'm actually tempted to build a second one. Uh, and you'll start seeing that this is going to be the order of business, really. Uh, we'll get frustrated with how slow... It, uh, how long it's taking to produce a certain thing. And so we'll upgrade stuff but let's have a look at what we unlocked because uh, i imagine some of you are going nuts watching me wandering around without having checked out mining rods i need two steel that's very expensive and welcome back hopefully with no non-exploded ears i'm gonna have to remember to cut out that coughing fit there uh if you can't already tell from my voice i've, I've got a bit of a sore throat at the moment and uh yeah that didn't feel too good it felt like i was actually trying to evacuate my lungs from my body uh but we are here we've taken magic uh, you haven't missed much i just took my level and we are now in a position where we can go ahead and should be able to grab our first mining rod. So let's go ahead and have a quick look at this. There we go. We've got exactly enough steel. It's got an AOE. Um, so let's find somewhere where that AOE is going to be useful. There aren't actually many places for, for it right now. Let's have a look. Can we buy land at all? We can. We can buy a bit of land. Well, given that, let's have a look. Oh, um, Okay, that's not exactly useful to me, I'll be honest. Uh, that's not that's not a lot of land. Let's let's try and grab this land. <sighs> they look incredibly cute, but if you're wondering what the <sighs> was from, well, I'm familiar with, with with this delightful family down here. They are truly delightful. You're amazing, and we love you. The problem is, it's Unfortunately, fairly easy to clobber them while you're trying to defend yourself, as I found out in my test game. And uh, the guilt. Oh my god. Happy little beat family. You're my favorite person in the history of ever. Uh, the worst thing is when you clobber. I'm not gonna even gonna demonstrate it. I'm just gonna give you the benefit of my wisdom, okay? I clobbered them. And it was it was an accident. But the worst part was. They said, I'm sure you have our reasons. We still love you. It's like, no, no. Don't like me for hurting you. It makes it feel so much worse. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, I, I have no idea if there's some method by which I can, uh, I can make their lives better. But that little family over there, I'm going to do my very best to keep them safe. Whether that is going to uh, happen or not. Well, we will have to see. Right, do I have enough glass? Uh, well, I've got some glass on me already. I want some bottles if I can get some. There we go. I've got to get two of these glow bugs. Now, this building over here, I believe, is a museum. You can sort of think like uh, 
well, Stardew Valley in, in the community center or, or the actual museum in any number of games like Animal Crossing, etc, etc. Let's have a quick chat. Welcome to the museum. Our collections are, well, rather incomplete at the moment. Feel free to help me fill the bundles. You will get a reward for each one completed. And a super special reward if you complete them all. I have no idea what kind of rewards we can expect, but uh, we've got archaeology. We can actually look at them and all kinds of things. I imagine we dig those up. Building, so your general crafting supplies. Uh, mining, uh, general raw resources. Also, no idea what that is. Uh, we've got alchemy, so potions. Uh, we've also got cooking, so actual cooked foods. We could, uh, If we can get some flour, we can already start satisfying that one. And we can... Uh, Capture some uh, insects as well, so trapping, we've got just foraging supplies, no idea about that, and farming, all sorts of things. We might actually be able to satisfy some of these. Uh, I can't place that one. I think that one goes under foraging, does it not? Yes, probably does. We are very close. I'm going to hold off for now, but can we... Ooh. Okay, so we've got a couple of options there. I like it. We, we may be able to get quite a few of those done reasonably fast. Right. How are we doing over here? It's probably going to take a little while for that to be ready, but uh, it shouldn't take too long. And then we'll be able to start. Uh, there we go. We've got a bottle. So let's go and grab you. Oh, no. Did I have any room? No. I Ah, right. Okay. I see what happened there. Um, okay. So I'm going to need to gobble down this meat rather quickly and then go and sell some of it. Because currently I do not have enough room. So we're going to get rid of all of that. Um, only got one hide. We'll get rid of that too. Uh, anything else I particularly want to dump out my inventory? Uh, the, the arrow as well. There we go. Right. With that done, can I upgrade anything? I can. Yes. Yes, give me the better backpack. Right. Hello, little family done. Uh, now, I don't know. It, it feels really awkward taking the beats while you're watching. <laughs> my God. Please, please don't say anything really sweet like, Oh, I know you're murdering our family, but uh, we love you anyway. You're so awesome. You're amazing and we love you. Ah, oh, please stop being so nice. I still feel guilty for accidentally hurting you. Ah, oh, my lord. Humans. Why, why do we pack bond with things that we know aren't alive and can't feel things? It hurts. Right, let's uh, continue gathering up some resources. I'm going to try and keep my manufacturing going. Oh, there we go. Add four more infantry slots. Marvellous. Let's uh, go ahead and make sure that we're making some of this. Half of them in there, half of these over there. Right, so we've got this mining rod, and I'm still not placing it down because I've been looking for something that's better for it. But you know what? Actually, okay, so if this works as I suspect... And that is, it automatically gathers things. Will it try to automatically gather the, the family? I really, really hope not. I super hope not. But I kind of fear that it might. Uh, for that reason, I'm really tempted not to put it down here. Um, and yet, this is probably one of the better places that I've got to, to put it. Uh, look, I really hope you can forgive me if this does, in fact, harvest your children. No? No? Ah, thank goodness. Ah, okay. Uh, right, so we're going to leave that there and hopefully it'll start gathering things. We'll swing by in a little bit and find that there's loads of resources on the floor for me to collect, which would be rather marvellous, I must say. So what else can we look into making? Now, the big backpack needs bones. We've got some of that and royal cloth. Uh, we haven't got hot peppers. Uh, can't get that. We can get a good amount of those. Wait a second. I just gathered... <gasps> It does. Oh, fantastic. What's more, it went straight into my inventory. That's even better. I'm uh, going to need a load of coal, unfortunately. So let's uh, get some coal going. And some brick as well. Right, okay. So we're probably going to want to pop those all over the place. And items have restocked. Excellent news. Uh, we can buy bottled beetles. Would we really want to, though? And a demon scroll. Would I really want a demon scroll? I can't imagine that I do. Uh, but what we do want is to expand out our building space. So let's see. It's going to cost 280 Is there anywhere I can afford? Uh, not really. But when, well, we're not far off that one. So we could use some of my coins to just straight up get that. 
Oh, alternatively, I could try and get the iron ingots needed to get a better shovel. Uh, we need hot peppers still, and that's still something that we don't have easy access to. Uh, sure, make me make me some coins. We'll see what we can do. Oop, that is my shovel, and not, in fact, my pickaxe. It's a common mistake, I feel. Okay, well, I'm gonna crack on, gather some more materials, and I shall bring you back when we're about ready to take a level up, or when I think we're ready to place down the windmill, which is gonna be a little ways off. So, see you soon. Welcome back to our level up. We are currently making some bricks and uh, I am presently mining plenty of wood ready to build our first windmill and also being attacked by slimes periodically. The scallywags. So there we go. There we are. Right. Oh, oh I'm, I am actually being landed on by some. Damn it. That menu is not nearly as safe as I am used to menus being. But oh well. Uh, got some uh, quite a few things over there that I want to pick up. But first, 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 let's go ahead and grab our next level up. Now, uh, I am re-tempted to go for agriculture. Uh, we've also got masonry. Uh, unlocks braziers. Structures cost 25% less stone. I mean, that wouldn't be a terrible one to get. Craftsmanship, we could get, oh, the royal steel and royal clothing. We get banking, which unlocks banks. Uh, that might be useful. Uh, drilling, carpentry, unlocks torches. Uh, structures cost less wood. That doesn't strictly make much of a difference to me, honestly. Cooking is really tempting, though. Uh, brilliant, obviously, to get uh, extra uh, EXP there. Unlocks inscription tables. Unlocks novice scrolls. Uh, that's tempting. Uh, farms yield 25% more resources. Animals yield 25% more resources. Honestly, I think we're going to go with agriculture, uh, simply because for no other reason than the, the, the leather that we need. We are hurting for leather, and if I can get a little bit more leather off the cows, uh, then I'd be pretty happy. Also, we've got everything you need. Thank you for the critters. You're welcome. You may keep these magic scrolls as a reward. What? Help the druid. Thank you very much, and you've got another quest. Okay. What would you like? Can I help? I'm afraid the natural resource exploitation is still going rampant. Could you bring me some tree saplings so I can make sure the forest is safe? I can certainly try. Uh, how do I get tree saplings? I have, do trees suddenly drop saplings? Is that maybe a skill I need to unlock? Uh, looks like. Or at the very least, I've not had any trees drop saplings so far. So I don't... Uh, unless something has changed simply because I've got the quest, I don't imagine that we're going to be getting them from the trees themselves. Still, oh, there's quite a lot of things we managed to get up there. Any more dig spots? No, nothing Nothing new at the very least. Ooh, one there, actually, speaking of. Uh, let me go and just drop off some items into the... Oh, hello. Uh, you are a fairy. And I just got all my energy back. Marvellous. I prefer... We've got a golden egg. Oh, that's worth a lot. Wait, that's one of the one of the things that we need for our pack. So I'm gonna keep hold of that one for now. There are a lot of random gubbins though that we could start selling. Uh, but I'm not sure if I want to sell it. Oh, that's worth quite a lot though. Uh, at the very least, I'll get rid of those arrows. Right. Okay. Oh, there's another fairy down. There. Oh, this is marvelous. I accept. Now this. Ouch. I was about to say this side will be clean because uh, the mining rod, but uh, apparently uh, not so. It wasn't clean of aggressive mobs, at the very least. Uh, I guess it's a mining rod, not a combat rod, so that makes sense. Uh, okay, right, so uh, what can we look at making next? I'm going to need some iron ingots. Can we make enough? Uh, we can make five. So that's nowhere near enough, but we can always grab a few more bits and bobs beside. Uh... The royal clothing we can unlock at the very least. So that's probably something we want to aim for fairly soon in order to uh, get a, the next item there. And we'll also grab all of these. But we should have enough now to put together our first windmill. Maybe our only windmill. I, I'm not sure if we're going to need multiples. But uh, in an incremental game, needing only one of something is fairly uncommon. Uh, let's go ahead. Granted, I'm not really playing this aggressively like an incremental game. I, I An incremental game, you tend to want to just like get more and more and more of everything. You play an incremental game more or less the same way most people play Factorio. Uh, right, let's see. Can I build this? Yes, I can. 
And it is a three by three. Perfect. Right. What do we do here? We can make flour out of wheat. Okay. And we can make animal feed out of jellies and flowers and poop. Pumpkin seeds, hot pepper seeds. Okay. So we're going to need the items before we can get any wheat seeds, beet seeds. Okay. Um, cotton. All right, so we could actually get a proper little farm going. I wonder if they replant themselves, like once we've planted it, whether we need to keep replanting it. Uh, we can also get tree saplings. How many do we, we need a lot. Oh well, no time like the present, I guess. Uh, we'll crack on with that. Now then, uh, I'm gonna need a load more coal, frankly. Uh, let's get half of that. I, actually, no, let's get 20. But I noticed we've got a lot of money burning a hole in our little pocket, so why don't we actually start expanding out a little bit. Um, we could start going in this area. That's actually really expensive, though. Uh, that's quite expensive as well. Honestly, we don't have many options that aren't expensive, but sure, we'll go ahead and grab this. Ooh, we've got a rainbow. How marvelous. And a dig spot. And something I can interact with. Explodey mushrooms. Am I losing it? Am I gaining anything? Are they healing me? They don't appear to be. Uh, if they're doing anything, I don't know what it is. Oh, they're all back. Um, okay. This looks like a puzzle. This game is full of puzzles. If anything doesn't make sense, look around. I'm fairly certain that we're meant to pop these in the colors of the rainbow. There we go. Marvelous. Oh, I'm going to need a key. What well, poop. Uh, very well. Uh, also, I would like your egg. I am apparently going to need poop too, though, because uh, we can now use it for something making animal feed. I, I'm not sure I agree with, with feeding animals poop. I feel this probably verges on, on animal cruelty in some capacity. Hmm. Alright, let's grab all of the fish. There we are. Right, I would like to... Well, we can't make the bread yet. We've at least got enough coal, though, to make some glass. So let's get that on the go. Uh, there we are. I'm going to need a key. So that's going to need some iron, unfortunately. Can I make... Oh, yeah, we I, I can make 10 iron ingots. Fantastic. We're actually getting a lot of resources of it. What? The? Oh. Well. I'm a bit of a derp. I uh, may have not been paying attention to my energy. I really need my wings to give me some health. Like, fantastically badly. Or I'm going to die. I'm not sure if this game has permanent death. Uh, or not. I mean, I guess I could for science it, but that would be a kind of rubbish second episode. Well, yes, everyone, I'm dead. Uh, there we go. I've got my key, though. Ah, oh, that, that auto pickup is very, very nice. There we go. Let's grab all of these while we're here. I'll probably pop some in some of the gold in to go uh sure all 11 right are there any aggressive cows no they're not Oof. we have got a lantern provides better visibility okay that's actually pretty cool i approve i approve a lot we have got 20 tree uh tree saplings it's fairly certain that i'd only queued up Five to be gotten though, so that's a bit of an interesting one. Uh, my my vampire wings really don't seem to be helping me out right now. This is most worrisome, most worrisome. Uh, perhaps I'm not killing the right things. I thought it just had to be any old enemy would do, but uh, okay. Oh, we're getting three a time. Well, I may be making a few too many then. My bad. Ah, fairy. Fairies. Fairies heal. I'm fairly certain. Come here. Fairy. Heal me. Oh, thank goodness. There we go. Ah, good old reliable magic. Oh, we just need a little bit more and we're good. Now, I'm not sure. Did that mention that it would make three at a time? Or was that just something you had to, to work out by making it the first time? Uh, if I missed it, my bad, everyone. I'm a little bit oblivious sometimes, especially when I'm feeling a bit rough. Uh, that, that, that most of the time actually rough or not let's be honest with ourselves uh, there we go all right let's go and have a chat with you thank you so much you have saved the forest from those guys with pickaxes yes I'm not one of those guys this may look like a pickaxe it's actually a totem 
Have one of each gem in your inventory. Gemologist, okay. Very well. Hello, friend. I have a final quest for you. It involves finding a rare dinosaur. A dinosaur egg? What are dinosaurs in this? If I can get this egg, I will be able to raise and protect the creature. Uh, dino friends are the best. Ones. I, I mean, I don't think you're wrong, but I've got a funny feeling you're going to release this dinosaur on the jerks with pickaxes, and I've also got a funny feeling that the dinosaur is going to be better at noticing that I'm one of those jerks than you are. Yeah, not entirely certain I like this plan. I'm going to be honest with you. I should eat. Very well. What should I eat? I'm going to eat some of my raw fish. There we go. Om nom 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 nom. Right, we're probably going to want to get to farming sooner rather than later. Uh, but for now, oh, let's grab you. Still just some bones, but oh well. Uh, I can buy some topaz. I can buy bottled milk or cheese. That sounds like it would be useful. Uh, but I'm really not sure it will be. Uh, is there anything I really want to sell? Not really, but oh, actually I'll sell I'll sell the... Uh, actually, I can sell these, these as well, the uh, saplings. No longer need them. So that worked out. Well, maybe I'll uh, have some things just being crafted purely as vendor trash. There we go. Be gone. All right, we're going to want eight gold ore. Can I make any steel? And, oh, I would be able to if I could make some coal. So let's go ahead and make 20 coal. That should be good. Uh, we can make the new shovel. Fantastic. Let's get that on a go. Okay. And we're still waiting on the peppers, I think. Oh, yeah, 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 no. You can dodge in this game. You can uh, use space and you'll do a quick old dodge, which may save your life. But uh, with the amount of health that we've got right now, probably unnecessary. Also, I can just walk underneath most of the enemies. They're not that obvious. Uh, and they're not that difficult to dodge. Uh, let's go ahead and take you up. Another arrow that we'll be selling fairly soon. Now, this whole area of... Oh, Water shovel. Dig area increased. Digging irrigates the... Ooh, fantastic. Okay, so that, that definitely sounds like we should be looking into doing some farming then. Uh, very well. Let's see about over in this direction, shall we? How much is that going to cost us to buy? Uh, it's actually 350 or 320 Well, let's go for the 350 first. So many fairies. I approve. I accept. Uh, actually, I'm fairly certain I need to bottle some of these fairies. I will bottle you and I will bottle you. Then I will collect all of the fairies. Ah, oh, this is fantastic. Also, I've got a level. Good times. Let's go and check out what we can get with this. Okay. Um, manufacturing. All structures have a 20% chance to craft double items. Oh, that sounds good. Um, engineering. All structures work 25% faster. Unlocks droids and EMP grenades. That sounds like something I don't need to worry about right now. Uh, the royal cloth is definitely something I want. Unlocks boots and gloves. Also unlocks amulets. Now, I've been told to go for amulets in the comments, so I may well grab that one just because, but... No, we're going to grab cooking first. Let's go ahead and grab cooking because I'm fairly certain... Oh, what's this? Uh, slain enemy drop coins. Oh, yes, please. Fairly certain that uh, cooked food will heal us, so let's try and get that. Hello. I didn't dodge in time. That's fine. Let's get all of your bits. And I will also accept you. Nope. Naughty. Right. Okay. Uh, can I interact with this? No. Very well. Uh, this looks like a nice little place to do some farming, though. So, sure. Let's... Uh... Oh. Very nice. Oh, yes, it did mention dig area increase, didn't it? I was just being dumb. I... Ooh, random sand is good, I guess. There we are. Uh, do we have... Uh, well, I've got a bunch of saplings, but it's not actually what I want to use. So let me go and uh, drop these off. I guess I should have prepared and gotten myself plenty of... Uh, plenty of crop seeds first before dig in the area, but I wonder if uh, that'll hang around for very long. Let's go ahead and drop off some things, I guess. Uh, we've got foraging. The flowers? Oh, they are. Fantastic. Uh, berries? Yes, also. Uh, okay. And, well, I could use some of that, sure. Uh, that has cleared out my inventory a little bit. Uh, farming? 
I, I'm going to keep the wheat because I'm going to make more of it in a moment. Uh, I can also put... Well, I'll keep this as well, actually. Uh, the eggs we could drop off. But before I do, I would like to check out cooking, I guess. That would probably be wise. Uh, drop off some fairies. I am going to need to get more of those, it seems. Uh, archaeology. Oh. Okay, I thought I was going to be dropping off a golden egg there, but apparently not. I've got... Well, I've been given advice not to get rid of my gems early on. So I'll probably hold on to those for just a little bit. Just in case they end up being something I desperately need. Is there no way for me to make that small? I really hope those don't uh, hang around then. Uh, if there's no way of me... Well, actually, no. They... they well, that, that being said... Uh, I was going to say they haven't hung around before, but these are irrigated ones. Will it will it make a difference? We will soon find out. Uh, nevertheless, let's go ahead and make... Um, let's not use all of it. Let's make 15. Also, can we get a second one? Uh, we need a bit more brick. All right. How much brick can we do? Uh, we've got 10, so we only need 20. There we go. Let's get that on the go. Uh, I'm going to want... Plenty more coal as well, so let's go and grab some of this. Now, these fairies don't half give a decent bit of uh, EXP. I approve of that quite a lot. There we are. Kill 100 enemy. What? We must find out. Rubbish, rubbish. Uh, actually, not too bad. Uh, rubbish, rubbish. Uh, kind of okay. Perfect. I approve! Cute Thulu has been unleashed! Ah, life is grand. There we go. But we did unlock cooking. Let's go ahead and have a look. Can we do anything with that? Uh, we can make a sprinkler. I want to see how big that affects things. I need coal and I need brick. Oh, damn it. Okay, well, we're making brick. I guess that makes sense to, to go for that over another windmill though these windmills take an awfully long time to do their stuff so i wouldn't mind getting more of them uh yeah i think we're definitely gonna go for more i'm also thinking of maybe moving these up and around this little island because it's a tiny little island this doesn't really seem fit for for much but we could have a, a windmill here just a little walkway around it and then fishing traps all the way around that i think that might actually be really really good uh, that being said, I wonder how big a uh, a cook pot is. How much room that requires. We're going to have to have a look into that one. Uh, let's go ahead and grab you. Nothing much there, unfortunately. Okay, well, I'm going to save up until uh, we've got enough to either build the windmill or the cook pot. And uh, by the time you come back, I'll have made a decision on which one we're going to build first. Okay, we finally managed to get together enough coal to build our cook pot. So let's go ahead and get that down. In the end, I'm... Uh, ooh, actually, it's a fairly small building, but sure. Compared to the windmill, at the very least. Right, let's have a look in this. We can make sandwiches, pizza, cookies, ice cream, meat, skewers, soup, uh, fruit salad, with something we haven't seen before, or we can use up all of our seaweed and fish to make sushi. I approve. Let us do that. We will clear out our inventory and hopefully it's going to be better than just eating the seaweed and... Oh, they got 50 items. Marvelous. Uh, the seaweed and the um, fish on their own. Uh, we've obviously seen, obviously seen that you can make cooked fish, but hopefully the sushi is just generally better. There we go. We are still collecting quite a lot of random arrows. Who keeps going around and burying these arrows? Who knows? Uh, because I'm fairly certain I've dug in the same place and, and gotten arrows multiple times at this point. It's not just uh, that we're at the site of some ancient battle. No, no, no. Someone is going around and burying arrows. For what reasons? Who can say? Right, there we go. Right. Oh, and all of our crops appear to be ready. Fantastic. Oh, look at this. There we go. Let's get all of these. Now, that is quite a lot of wheat. My energy is low, though. Uh, so let's go down some of this. Ooh, that sushi does restore quite a lot. It's more than the fish by itself, at the very least, but also gives an enormous amount of hearts. Two hearts in total. That's fantastic. With all of this wheat, we'll make some into uh, more um, seeds, but we will use a lot of this to make some uh, flour so that we've got some bread. Ooh, hello. Uh, rather not be hit by you right now. Thank you. 
There we go. Uh, can I pick that up? Yes, I can. Marvelous. Okay, well, let's have a look at our level then. What are we going to put our points into next? We've uh, we can't, actually kind of quite tempted. Slain enemies drop coins. But oh, there's so many other things. So many things. We could go for inscription. We could go for brilliance. Um, we could, of course, go for banking. Or we can go for jewelry. I'm going to go for the jewelry because, uh, again, I had been told that this may be something that I want to have a look at. Oh, wait. What, what on earth was that? Is this science in this game? Have a look. What are you? Physics. Unlocks power plants. Uh, okay. Very well. I have no idea what that is going to be useful for. Maybe some of the later bit of maybe the factory needs power. Hmm. Interesting because I hadn't really considered that before, but uh, with the way that the, uh, the tech tree works, you could probably unlock something before you have any prerequisite techs needed to make use of it. So if the factory did need power, but I'd approached it by going through the, the nature route, then it might end up, or, or just any any other uh, neighboring technology, uh, it might end up being a case that, well, uh, I've got this, this wonderful new thing, but I can't actually do anything with it. Uh, that would be a pretty brutal uh, wake-up call. I would not approve. I'd be so excited. I've got power plants, or rather, I've got factories. And it's like, yeah, you need to power them now. Like, oh, why? I'm going to have to wait an entire level before I can do that now. Right, there we go. Right, so, with all of that, then, we need to keep up with gathering all of the fish. Ah, uh, see, now I want seaweed. Got well, loads of fish, but I need seaweed. There we go, that's another sushi for me. Perfect. Right, let's have a look in on the market. What have we got in here? We can buy plastic for an inordinate amount of money. I can buy key. I can buy some ice cream. Uh, I don't need to. I'm making my own. Uh, is there anything else I really want to drop off? Uh, it's not really worth that much, let's be honest. That's worth a lot less than I was expecting. That's a bit of a shame, actually. Got quite a lot of wheat, though. I wonder what bread would sell for. Perhaps we should have a quick look into that. Let's go ahead and uh, make some flour. Uh, requires two wheat per. So let's make half of this. We'll, well, we'll make... Actually, how much is required? Oh, damn it, I can't check. Uh, I don't know how much flour is needed. So, sure, we'll just make a straight half. We'll make 22. There we go. And let's keep things moving over here. Do you need to get to that royal cloth? Unfortunately, I am dragging my feet with that one. But hopefully, very soon, we'll have it. Let's pop in and see what cute Thulu can deliver. Uh, some more oranges. Sure. Um, we... Oh! Fantastic! I approve. I still haven't used those, though. I probably should. Uh... Got eggs are plenty, but I don't really want to give those up. I, I mean, I guess I could drop off some of the wheat. If I strictly had to, which I don't, so we're not going to for now. Um, gonna need to get some more jars. I need two more fairies and I need five glow bugs. Uh, I could drop off five of my uh, sushi, sure. Uh, five bread as well. Okay, that's not too bad. As for the mining. We're actually not doing very well with this. I'm really re reluctant to give up my, my gems just yet. So we're going to hold on to those for now. But how far off are we from making more steel? It's really only the coal that's holding me back right now. Oh, let's get that on the go then. I would love to get some more steel and maybe build another mining rod. Automating the mining seems like a really, really good idea right now. Uh, that said as well, uh, are these right? Wow, they were ready fantastically quickly. I am actually quite impressed with that. Though some of them seem to be losing the tiles underneath. Maybe they despawned underneath? Yeah, I think I have no idea, but either way, it isn't really that much problem for me to, to make more. Uh, let's go ahead and gobble down some of those. There we are. I'm going to want some more wheat seeds, I think, following this. Or well, maybe some more cotton, since I am running out of thread. Either way, we've got options. What the? How long were you there? Sweet child. Let my fairies rest your weary body. I need to ask you a for a very small donation. I will reward you with the power of my fairies. May light shine on your quest. A thousand gold? They're having a laugh. Do you know how much land I could buy with that? Well, actually, 
Please tell me there's a chicken. Oh my. <sighs> Thank goodness. I was quite worried what kind of mutant cow we had just uh, gotten an egg from. Uh, I do need to go get myself some more uh, some more glass. Let's go ahead and do this then. Uh, it's going to take a lot of our coal. Well, uh, just go for f for a little bit. Yeah, coal is is a bit of a problem for us right now, and that is going to continue to be a problem. I fancy. Uh, maybe I believe there are a couple of biomes in this in this game. Uh, at least there's more than this grassy plains biome. Maybe we'll find coal in one of the others uh, because right now that is not going particularly well for us. I'm sorry, Beast, but you're in my way. There we go. I couldn't see what was behind you. There we are. Now, brothers, hello. Uh, I would like to get the plant, not you. There we go. And we can now place things down. Right, how much... Oh. Well. Ah, yes, we make it in the in the furnace. Ah, I'm a dirt. Okay, off we go. Let's go have, ahead and have a look. How much does it... One piece of coal per bread? I kind of feel that that is not a brilliant return... But fine, we're gonna we're gonna get five so that I can at least finish off the um, the part of the cooking bundle, the bread entry in there. I mean, we're getting a couple of odd bits here and there. Now we did unlock amulets. Ah, there we are. I just remembered that we'd unlock that. Four iron ingots, one ruby, one emerald. I approve. Let's let's make that that a thing that happens. I uh, still just need the hot peppers, though. There we go. I keep hoping that every island we unlock will be a new biome, but so far, my luck has not really uh, lent itself to that particular quest. There we go. Let's go have a little bit more. The only part of the island that is at all clear is this little bit down here, which is kind of amusing. Okay. Gain 25% more resources. Uh... Firstly, thank you very much for the advice. Secondly, I can see why you were all enamored with the amulet so much. Oh my goodness. Wish I'd realized that earlier. I would have made much more of a beeline for it. I get the impression that a second playthrough of this you we would involve doing things much, much better. Slimy amulet. I can make it straight away. <gasps> Fantastic. I approve. Uh, sure, let's get some more coal going. Um, sure, some more glass as well. Can I get more thread? Can I get more leather? I can. Let's try and keep everything working at all times. There we go. Hello, slime. Let's get rid of you. But getting a thousand gold is not something I'm looking forward to. Also, I really, really kind of feel that I would prefer to use that to expand my area of influence and get more, more islands rather than giving it to a fairy. I'm sorry, fairy, but uh, I, I really kind of feel that I'll do better with that gold than you will. 50% more resources. I approve. Uh, can I get in there? There we go. Perfect. Nope. Let me grab that. Thank you. Right, now. Do we have the bread? We do. 24 inches. Less than, than this, but uh, it is just wheat. Wheat and... Well, actually, no. It's wheat and coal. Hmm. Actually, let me go and check how much that would sell for. I think the, the sushi only sells for five at the market. What about the bread? So bread sells for nine. Okay. So bread does sell for a lot better. All right. So bread is going to be my cash crop. That's actually incredibly fitting, considering that is pretty much what it used to be for a long time. But then we are using the, the coal for it too. So swings around about really. Um, let's get 14 seeds on the go as well but this first bread is going straight into the cooking bundle let's go ahead and get that one on the go there we are now uh, we seem to be doing it all right with more or less everything else for the time being at the very least i do want to get more foraging going on and that probably will be one of the first bundles that we manage to finish i imagine all right let's have a look a bone annual <gasps> i've already got the bone Eight steel, though. But, I mean... If it means we get more resources, I'm in favour of it. Quite heavily in favour of it, actually. 
still though, it's a lot of lot of steel. Or or you could put it that's a lot of money because anything I use to make steel I could have just sold. But let's go and see if we can't make a bit of cash then. Uh, we've got plenty of thread that we could sell. Uh, I could sell these. I'm gonna sell No, I meant to sell only one! Hoop! I wanted to see <laughs> I right clicked instead of left clicked. I meant to to use one and then sell one. Hoop. Oh well. I'm sure we'll we'll figure that out a little bit better. We could grab this one or No, maybe one of the more pricey lands is better and has better stuff on it. Um Sure, let's go for it. Ooh. New biome. Fantastic! I approve. So the expensive ones are different biomes. Uh, okay. And who be you? Let's try and get over there, shall we? Hello. It's dangerous to go. Oh, no, really. Take that. No. No, please. Ah. Oh. Really? Well, you know what? That is, that is better than what I was expecting. I'll, I'll be honest. I, I, I will I will be honest. Star Bomb has filled my mind with terrible, terrible fear of uh, helpful old men offering uh, offering adventurous help. Uh, yeah. No. Some swords are not meant to be wielded. Right, let's go ahead and chop down this tree. Do we get a different type of wood? We do not. But I did notice over here uh, some more arrows again. Oh, well. Um, my bird friend told me about the existence of golden eggs. Uh, in all my years, I've never seen one. I would sure like to, though. If only someone was young and awesome enough to find one for me. Hint, hint. Oh, we haven't... Oh, I haven't handed it in. Okay, well, sure. Actually, I'm... I'm hmm. I, I should have tossed that up. Well, there's no way of us seeing what we'll get from it, so... I guess it's just flipping a coin. This is surprisingly underwhelming. Oh, well, maybe I should have just given it to the museum then. It won't hatch into a lovely bird friend. And I can't even eat it. Those are the only purposes of an egg. This has been... Disappointing. Ah! Did you just try to kill me? I think you may have. I need a key. Uh, let's go and grab one of those. There we are. Perfect. Uh, we're at level 18. Levels are coming uh, not as fast as I had hoped, but uh, perhaps with more automation that would help out a little bit. Though I am kind of... Uh, we, we are noticing we're not getting EXP for uh, for crafting, which does suck a little bit, I'll be honest. Uh, if we did get a bit of EXP from crafting, then this would be significantly easier to do. Uh, let's double that down. But alas. Right. Okay. Key acquired, I think. Yes, key acquired. Let's go and see what we've got. Please, please be a sword, but not that kind of sword. Oh, okay. A top hat. Coins are worth 50%. I, I approve. Oh my lord, look how dapper I am. Sorry, Cthulhu, but you can't compete with this kind of dapperosity. Walk into the waterfall. Um, <laughs> really? You know what, 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 what was I expecting? What was I expecting? It's fine. Uh, let's grab a little bit over here. I wonder, though. Hang on a second. If I were to make this area a little farm, would my mining rod gather the produce of said farm? Uh, let's let's not dig underneath my friends over there. Is this going to be really really awkward for you to watch happen? I mean, it's weak, so one would assume that there are, there's no family ties there, but uh, you never can be too uh, too certain about these sorts of things. Still, hopefully you can forgive me. I'm fairly certain you forgive me of anything, including killing you, which makes it all the worse. Uh, there we go. Let's build all this out. Now we should be seeing the, the growth increase because we're using irrigated tiles. At least, I very much hope so. That would explain why we got the uh, achievement, at the very least. Let's get all of this around. There we are. And we'll just leave it at that. Hello. 
Right, I could perhaps put another mining rod down here and just allow it to gather more resources. That would be kind of awesome, I must confess. Oh yeah, it's gathering the the uh, produce for me. Oh, that's fantastic. Much approval. So much approval. You can have that one can be replanted as well. Ah, perfect. So plant the farms around the mining rods. Gotcha. Now, gather a little bit of coal, and then we're going to head over again. Well, yeah, we're way, way off. That's not going to be happening anytime soon, I'm afraid. Uh, I'm not even going to try and pursue that quest for now. Gold is far too useful for me in other ways. There we are. Now, uh, we need a lot of steel. How much can we make? We can still only make one. It, it's actually the iron ingots, though, that are holding us back, which is kind of surprising. There we are. I would have thought it would have been the gold. Hello. Oh, damn it. I fail every single time I try to dodge. I'm so bad at this. Why, I do not know. But it vexes me all the same. Right, there we are. Uh, perhaps we should make sure that we're making some seeds. Um, Sure, let's get some cotton seeds on the go. Can I make... No, I can't make any more. Uh, that's a bit of a shame. That's fine. Let's get all of this done. Now, again, bread would be a better thing to sell. But considering it uses... Ah! Damn it. I was uh, low on energy, it seems. But considering that it uses coal, and coal is fairly short supply right now, I'm not going to fall over myself to start selling that. Still, it is good to know what our crash crop is going to be. And we've already got the cotton seed, so I should be able to just keep that on the go. This farm should be quite profitable for us. Uh, well, at least in terms of providing us with plenty of food. I mean, it. I guess with the ground taken up by farms, we're not going to be seeing any actual mining uh, nodes spawning down there. And that may not be the best situation for us to have, let's be honest. Uh, it might actually be better to prioritize getting the... Uh, mining nodes spawning there instead, but still it's uh, worth worthwhile f for sciencing whether the mining rods could also farm because that does make farms probably a just that little bit more useful for us. Right, we're very close to our next level, uh, just about 100 EXP off, and let me just fill this in because that's going to drive me around the bend otherwise. There we go. And in terms of Yep, still waiting on the hot peppers. Um, would they perhaps spawn in the desert? Uh, that might be worth looking into. Uh, let's get 10 bottles. Brilliant. And I would like the iron to be stored in there. On a, oh, damn it. Well, poop. Now my inventory is all clogged. Not ideal, I'll be honest with you. We really do need that better backpack space, frankly. Uh, different colored ore rocks, though. Let's go and have a look at what they like. There we go. And there we are. Right, okay. Uh, doesn't seem to really be doing anything different, though. Uh, actually, no. No, I take that back. I think there's actually more resources in these. And there's our level. Fantastic. Okay. What a grand way to wrap up an episode. Let's have a look at what we can spend this level on. Um... I think we've gone fairly heavily into the uh, industry side of things. We've barely touched magic. So, it's or, well, it's either that or getting banking. I wonder if banks like generate interest or something. But we're going to go with Brilliant. Getting a 20% gain on EXP. That'll be quite useful. And we can get Alchemy or Swords. Okay. I was not expecting to see that in the magic tree that seems a little bit suspect frankly but sure we've unlocked or rather unlocked a path towards source i think that will probably be what we look at next if i'm perfectly honest we also need to get more money so we're probably going to start uh, going through and selling a lot of things to ooh, my inventory is apparently full uh selling a bunch of things to the market let's have a look if we can't drop anything off right now there we go and well, we've got a load of stuff that we can probably dump into the 
um, into the museum. But that's going to be it for me for now. I really do hope you've enjoyed it. We'll be joining me for the next. But until then, and as always, do take care, everyone. <laughs>